Coach Ned, the streak continues, 12-0 now. Yeah. This is impressive, and the atmosphere, I mean, it wasn't a packed house today, but the atmosphere was electric. It came down to heavyweight. Your guy gets it done. It was a close match. I think he was trailing by two. He hits a chin rip, gets the win. Yeah, just like we work every day, right? Yeah. Right. <laughs> no, it was, a, it was a fun duel. We we know they're always a team that's going to come out and wrestle hard, and you know, that's something we pride ourselves on, just getting after it and wrestling really hard. And, and uh, hey, it was good to get come out of that and then and get a W. And you know, some of our guys didn't quite get what they wanted out there, but really happy with my guys' attitude, how they approached the matches, how they attacked it out there. So it went really well. You know, for a team that's going to be a Division One team in Kentucky, you recruit in Ohio, Indiana, but there's a lot of guys in the starting lineup that are from Kentucky. Yeah, yeah we have three from Kentucky right now: 133, uh, 174, and uh, those guys are just. They're just getting after battling. Zach Cowan at 149. Um, lost a close one today. Real tough match. But, he, uh, yeah, just really proud of those guys. And, yeah, they like that Kentucky pride. They like having it here. So we need some more for sure. Absolutely. They wrestled hard. And, and I mean, it, it, this is, a, like I said, it's a fun atmosphere. And, you know, in a short time, you guys have built something special. This is arguably one of the, the coolest stories in NCAA wrestling right now. What, what do you guys attribute to that? Is it is it the support from administration? What, what what goes into that? Sure. Well, there's certainly a lot of support from administration and some of the relationships we've built with the wrestling team to be able to create this atmosphere. You know, uh, DWP has just been absolutely phenomenal for us to be able to provide these type of experiences for our wrestlers, for all of our fans that come in the door, right? Yeah, like you said, it's not just a wrestling match, it's a, it's a fan experience. And so that's really what we've been shooting for, and uh, it's working. You know, hey, today was a little tough for Sundays at one duel. is isn't probably ideal for everybody. We love a Friday night duel, but we had a good fan base that came out and got after it today and got loud for our team. And, um, yeah, there's a lot that we can attribute to it, but, you know, mainly the guys. What do you, you what know? do you have to, to say to guys that are maybe on the fence about, you know, they want to wrestle Division One, but they also maybe want to stick close to home? What, what do you have to say to guys like that? Yeah, you know, I think you got to do what's on your heart. If you want to wrestle Division One, wrestle Division One. You know, go get it. And you know, obviously we, we're a little biased. We think this is the best place to do it. You know, um, but uh, we didn't, we wouldn't want anybody to settle for anything less if that's what they want. And so, being on the fence, well, why not shoot for the best, right? And so that's why we uh, we want to see that happen. We want to see our guys from Kentucky all over the place, making sure they're trying to wrestle here at Bellarmine. Absolutely. Well, Coach, again, you guys are 12-0. and 0. The streak continues. You guys beat a tough Gardner-Webb opponent today in the SoCon. Tough conference. Best of luck to you guys. What's after What's after this for you guys? Yeah, so we'll uh, we'll hit, hit the road here. We've we'll, uh, got a couple of road duels out east so against other SoCon opponents. So I'm um, looking forward to those as well. But, uh, yeah, we'll just take one match at a time. Awesome. Well, congratulations, Coach. It was a, an exciting duel today, and uh, safe travels. Thanks, man. Appreciate yeah. it.